back, everyone. We're live on Facebook, so hi to everybody out there. Like us and follow us. We will share the show uh, later on today. Uh, I do want to bring in my next guest, who's a newbie, but I think you're going to love it. It's something different. We've never talked about anything like this, especially for, in a very long time on my show. I have with me Dan Packard. He is with Art Prize. Welcome to the show. I know you want to tell everybody a little bit about Art Prize and what it is, and then what is going on that you've got going on special tomorrow. Hi, Carol. It's really great to be on the show with you. Um, you. I'd love to talk about Art Prize and what we have going on tomorrow night in downtown Phoenix. So Art Prize is the world's largest international art competition. We have we have 1,500 artists from 45, 45 countries. We give away $600,000 in cash prizes and grants, direct grants to artists every year. That's awesome. We have a $125,000 grand prize that's awarded by a public vote and a $50,000 grand prize that's awarded by a jury, by an art jury, and a number of small, smaller cash prizes from $10,000, $15,000 for category awards. It's open to any artist that works in any medium. Wow. So anyone can apply by going to www.artprize.org. Uh, unfortunately for this year, uh, artist registration is closed, but next year, Keep it in mind, it happens every fall in September and October in Grand Rapids, Michigan, of all places. That I mentioned 750,000 people attend and buyers from all over, everything's for sale. So if you're an artist and you want to get your art out there and sell and be seen, this is the place to do it, plus a life-changing grand prize. How exciting, and let me just say, where else but on Networking Arizona would you hear about something like this? That's what I love about this show, is there's so much information for people out there. Now, that's Art Prize. You yes. can check it out on the website, which is Art prize.org and may, if you know, we're going to talk a little bit about the organization and everything mm -hmm. in just a minute but if any medium that's awesome if you want to get involved with that maybe it's you maybe it's someone that you know tell them about this this is really really cool now I want to talk about what's happening tomorrow all right well tomorrow in downtown Phoenix we're having the finals of our Arizona pitch night competition so every year we have and this is the only place that Art Prize does a local competition that feeds into the national finals, you know, in, in Michigan in fall, Arizona only so far. So uh, it's a statewide competition open to any artist residing in the state of Arizona, working in any medium. We picked five finalists who are going to be presenting tomorrow night in downtown Phoenix at Garment League. It's open to the public, free to attend. We have art jurors there, the, the artists, the five finalists. Every one of these artists is great. I'm, this is maybe the first year I'm, I'm thinking anyone could win, and I'd be happy if any of them take our, take our prize, our grant, to go to Art Prize and be featured in a spot in the middle of the, the convention center in the heart of Art Prize, in a spot you couldn't get if you didn't enter a competition like this. Just think about it. How many artists out there would love to get their work seen? This is the perfect opportunity Absolutely. for that. It's and kind of like the American Idol for art. I love that. The American Idol for art. Now, this is free to the public. It's happening tomorrow. And doors open at 7. And mm -hmm. then, of course, the uh, event starts at 8. Yes. You can check them out. It's at Garment league in downtown Phoenix. Yes. And uh, you can also check out the information all about it. It's art wins this is the the one that's uh, more locally artwins.org that's our Arizona organization that's separate but affiliated with our prizes artwins.org how cool is this maybe you are an artist you want to go check it out so you can get involved somehow and then do it for next year right. maybe you are an art enthusiast it sounds like those people would go if you like to buy art those kind of people would go too yeah. correct anyone who loves art she, you should come. This is so cool. Check it out on the website. It is artwins, with an S, dot org. Now, um, I want to talk about how you got involved. Well, I grew up in Grand Rapids, Michigan. I moved to Arizona for college and been here ever since. But it's my original hometown, and I'm still connected, and I'm an attorney in my other life, and so I'm also licensed to practice law in Michigan. was going back and forth, and I just saw what Art Prize did for the city of Grand Rapids and how much energy and, and, and revitalization it brought to downtown. And I talked to the leadership there and I said, you know, what, what do you think about Arizona? And they said, go do it. And that was back in 2016. 
So we've been doing this competition every year since then. We've sent six finalists to Art Prize so far from Arizona. Wow, I bet so, we've got a lot of great uh, artists. I'll, I'll bet we'll send another one this year, and I want to send a grand prize winner one year. So. That sounds so cool, you guys. It is tomorrow, and it is uh, from 7. The doors open up at 7. The event starts at 8. It's going to happen at the Garment League in downtown Phoenix. Check it out on their website, which is Art Wins. That's with an S. Dot org. You also want to maybe go up onto the artprize.org website so that you can go check out all about it, how it started, and even if you want to get involved, which we're going to talk about that now. So you can either go to artwins with an S, dot org, that's for here, for tomorrow, get all the information about the event tomorrow, or you can go to art prize.org and that's about the organization now I want to go back to some of these things that I wanted to ask you about again how so how does somebody participate well there are a number of ways you can participate so registration is is online so you can go to artprize.org and the registration opens in the early spring and it stays open uh, for until June it's already closed for, for this year mm -hmm. so you can sign up at the art prize website or you can uh, enter our Art Wins Arizona competition for the grant in the featured spot. So it's a better spot than you would get by signing up at the Art, Art Prize website. So I have a question. Yes. So people are listening to this. They might be an artist who has uh, some beautiful paintings or what have you, play, whatever. And they want to get involved and they want to be seen. Mm -hmm. Do they have to go through a process where they first have to show their work and then you see if they're even eligible because there's artists it depends. and then there's me? It depends. <laughs> I mean, so, so anyone can enter, but you have to match with a venue. So it's, it's sort of like a, a dating swiping site, right? Okay. So the, the venues register, the artists register, and then they have to match. So if the venue wants you, you're, you're in. But you, there's also, uh, you can apply for featured public project grants, which are up to $25,000. We have five featured public project grants and a number of smaller grants. If you want one of those, though, you have to have a, a pretty pretty wow proposal to get, to get a $25,000 grant. But all, all the grant information is on the artprize.org website. Well, I think that's amazing, and anybody who's an artist really should be looking it's, into it's, this. It's radically open. Uh, any, 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 any age, any, any person? Any, uh, you have to be over 18. Oh, over 18. So over, you have to be over, over 18, 18 to get involved. Anywhere can be a venue, so uh, it activates all of downtown uh, restaurants, bars, hotels, office buildings, vacant lots. It's just an expl a citywide explosion of art. Well, check it out. Now, uh, the, the organization, you would check it out at Art prize.org now for the event that's happening tomorrow that he's super 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 excited about because it's open to the public it is completely free to go to and it's going to be a blast to go especially if you love art and it is going to be uh, happening at the garment league downtown phoenix and again it starts the well it the doors open at seven and then the event starts at eight so it's going to be a ton of fun get yourselves over there you're going to have a blast uh, now for people who want to maybe get like let's say donate and they yes. want to get involved with the organization can they do that or and what are you looking for well any, anyone who wants to volunteer we always need volunteers uh be interested in if, if somebody wants to be on the board the local board would be interested in that and you can of course donate we're always appreciative of you know the money goes all the money that's donated goes directly to the artists so there's no nothing taking off the top for administration you donate money, that's going to go to our prizes, 100% that we give to the artists. And you can do that at artwins.org. Isn't that me. cool? Yeah. That's really cool. Check it out, artwins, with an S, dot org. Now, uh, so you need volunteers. And um, so when people volunteer, what are some of the things that they would be doing? Oh, well, <laughs> helping to organize our pitch night competition, and helping, helping to run it. So the, the people that, that we have are... Are very busy and we can always use use more anywhere from you know checking people in to uh, getting the word out to local artists to um, you know my gosh what's your it's, it's favorite un, part unlimited. about the event that you're doing it tomorrow you're all my, you my, said you're up to your uh, eyeballs yeah, in getting this together. my favorite part of the event is seeing the, the, the transformative change that, that we an energy that frankly we, we brought in our little six or seven years of existence we've made an impact across the state and I love I love seeing that 
And I love seeing the change that we've made in the lives of the artists that have won our grants and have gone to Art Prize and being able to participate and experience this. It's, it's just it's really rewarding to see. I think that when you're an artist, that's one of, the, one of the things that's the hardest the most is being able to get that art recognized and seen. Mm -hmm. And yeah. this is like a giant gallery. Yeah. <laughs> is what it sounds like to me. Life-changing grand prizes. The, fir the, fir the guy that first won Art Prize, Rand Mortner, he couldn't pay his phone bill. And he won the grand prize. And, and what was the grand prize? It was a hundred. It was only a hundred thousand dollars back then. But but that was in, in. that was in two thousand nine. So Can I do my stick figures? No. Now, <laughs> now that that was a catalyst for him. Now he works and lives in New York City and employs other artists to work for him in the studio. Somebody that couldn't pay his phone bill won our prize, and now. Has this great career. That is a wonderful, wonderful story. You could check him out on uh, the website for the organization. It is artprize.org. And then tomorrow night, he is so excited. This event is happening at Garment League in downtown Phoenix. It's inside. It's, it's outside in the courtyard event space. Okay. And it's going to be a beautiful night. It's so going to be nice fabulous. Night to be and you know what? You're going to love it because if you're into art, people that love art, they really do. You yeah. may want to look to buy stuff. You might just want to walk around and check it out. Uh, again, it is going to be at Garment League in downtown Phoenix. Check it out. It is Art Wins with an S. 